create a hand tied bouquet, which is which you, you may have seen kind of sitting outside Lovely Florist with the, the spiral technique. So that's what I'm going to show you how to create. Lay out all your ingredients um, properly conditioned so you can just work with it very quickly. So we're laying out the foliage here. So we've got paper whites, lilac, Gelder de Rose, prunus, delphiniums, anemones, most gorgeous ranunculus. Okay, so we've got them all laid out in front of us, but what's really important is that we condition them. They, they drink up through the bottom, so anything that gets in the way before the head of the flower is going to get the water first, so that's why we remove things. So you've got to be quite ruthless and oh, cut bits off. You want to start with um, your leading lady, your kind of biggest flower, your bulkiest one, just because it's quite good stability. So I'm going to take the main flower and hold it between my thumb and my forefinger, very loosely. The grip is really important. If you hold it like that, you're gonna get decapitate everything and it's just not gonna work. So we're gonna hold it loosely here. So I'm gonna take some foliage and I'm gonna diagonally on top, put it and together. And then with this hand, I'm gonna turn it back, loose grip. So we're going diagonal, turn loose grip. On top, turn. The spiral technique allows us to lift and bring things higher or lower so it, it's just much more manageable. And use the foliage to kind of support and lift as well. And I'm happy with that. So with your forefinger, we're going to hold it down to, to support it. And you want quite a, a tight grip, but not too tight that you decapitate them all. And just wind it around a couple of times. So this is really important to loosen it up. Now we're gonna wrap it, just because it just looks so much nicer. 